Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Cautious here, and my god, time literally blows away pretty quickly. Games you waited to have a sequel finally do, and games waiting to be reimagined are now available for purchase. But that's not what we're talking about today. We're just gonna take a step back and look at the grand games that were the roots of what we play now. In this case, Grand Theft Auto's 2008 release, GTA 4. Let's say you did not know what the hell I'm talking about. Well, on Sunday, GTA 4 finally, officially actually, turned 10 years old, and knowing Rockstar, they always wanted to do something uh, special for their games hitting their 10 year mark. GTA 3's anniversary got a port for the Android and iOS, and four years later got a port to the PS4. This was the same for GTA Vice City, but Grand Theft Auto San Andreas's anniversary was quite fucking big. There were GTA 5 online events, there were collectibles that were limited edition and you had to buy them right away. There were also the regular, you know, Android and iOS port, and the reason why I keep saying that all of these three games were released for the PS4 is because Xbox doesn't need it because, well, they have backwards compatibility. Believe me, I was really excited to see GTA 4's remaster on current gen consoles or fix the broken PC port that they had. I'm reinstalling this just to show you the game can't even launch. And I'm telling you, I tried to fix this problem and nothing is working. If you know how to fix this, please let me know in the comments below. But damn, if only someone actually fucking fixed this shit besides giving us a shit 2017 update. If anything didn't happen, we were just going to lose some songs removed because of expired licenses, so... Yeah, that's unfortunately what we got. I wouldn't be surprised if Rockstar Games or any Rockstar parent company in general were just working on GTA or any other project like Red Dead Redemption and just didn't care. To prove that, not a single tweet about GTA 4 from any of these companies was even present. But hey, at least the multiplayer for GTA 4 is going pretty strong after 10 whole years. Alright guys, that's about it for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, subscribe with notifications, and I'm out. Peace.